Wow, so this is the very first time I'm outside and it's so freaking hot and I don't like to wear a mask all the time but you have to I guess and yeah I'm about to go shopping now first in the Grand Indonesia and then I'll go to the Plaza Indonesia and yeah I'm really excited I need a few things so let's see what they what they got where I am right now. It's called the Grand Indonesia Mall. Honestly, this was so hard to enter and I literally swear because I couldn't get in. I mean, I need internet or something. I don't know why Penduli Lindungi wasn't working, but they were very helpful at the entrance and you actually have to scan your QR, QR code where the security check is. It's, it reminds me a bit on the Philippines because they have the same security regulations and yeah I'm finally made it and I got lost a bit first because uh, I couldn't figure out where I am and the elevator was also very confusing Unfortunately, I didn't found a bra yet. Hopefully soon. And yeah, the mall seems to be quite big, so you can spend a whole day here. But I only have one or two hours left till I have to go back to um, my hotel, which is just across the street. But let's see what I will find next or where I go next. So I'm searching for Oisho. Google says it should be in the East Mall and I'm currently in the East Mall. I found it finally. But I can't find the shop. And obviously the people who are working here don't know where which shop is. But that's okay, I will find it. That was a fail. Oisho didn't exist. And I didn't find found something to shop so maybe next time. So I'm ready to go to the mall now and I prepared myself and hopefully I will find something to shop in the plaza or in the Grand Indonesia. See you soon. So I guess this would be the favorite mall for my mom. I guess and it's not that crowded like the other one where I went yesterday. So I believe they have everything here, like Lubuta, Valentino, Gucci, every designer you can imagine. But I feel like I'm lost again. I don't know where the normal shops are and uh, I need to sit down and have a break. Destination for now. had a nice pancake which was quite pricey and a mocha um, at the Graham, Graham pancake coffee shop here in the plaza and you can tell that there are different people I would say they have money because otherwise the coffee won't work here maybe that's the reason why it's located here but let's check out Zara again and I have to go to Oisho so I like the fact that they have a 
I don't know, help system to find different shops. This is here. Found it. My gosh, no underwear for me. Maybe I will have a look next time or in Bali, I don't know. Other than that, if I'm going to buy some clothes here, I have to pay more for my overweight, overweight luggage. So that's a good thing. I feel like it's so difficult to cross the street here and so busy and I have to ask many people to get to the mall where the entrance is. So I feel like it's very nerve-wracking to always scan the QR code um, with the Pinduli Lindungi app because I'm from Germany and it doesn't work. My certificate is not approved yet so I always have to show my uh, my book with the vaccination. So the staff is currently looking for having a look on the price because for the eye mask and the nose strips there are no prices here and I'm about to buy some uh, treatment for my face and my hair and yeah let's see how much it is at the end. So we don't have much Mark and Spencer anymore in Germany, so it's so exciting to be here again. But actually they don't have the drinks they had in the past, so not that good. So I saved up to 30%, I just paid 10 euros and 177 IDR I guess. And actually it has, it has to um, be more than 20 euros, but I don't know what she did with the discount so I'm leaving now because my battery is dying from my phone and otherwise I can't order a grab so this is really important for me and I don't know when the uh, mall is really empty maybe it's about to close but I'm not sure yeah anyways I have to go back